I'm not going back and forth with you. I said what I said. I'm not defending myself. So you're just going to ignore me. This conversation is over. So you're just not communicating. That's stonewalling. That's an abuse tactic. So that's it. It's like that. You know, you're the one who's making this relationship so friggin' difficult. You're unbelievable. This is abuse. A narcissist will do whatever it takes to convince you that your boundaries are abuse. You have to understand, you having boundaries is a threat to their dominance, to their power, to their control. The reality is, anytime you try to stand up for yourself, you're going to get an extreme reaction. If you don't share children with them, I suggest ending the relationship and going no contact. Yes, I know that that's incredibly difficult, but I still suggest it. If you do share children with them, then you want to go low contact. So you're not going to ignore anything that pertains to the children, but you are going to ignore their nonsense. And absolutely, they will tell you that you're not communicating, that you're being high conflict, that you're creating the problems. Hold firm. Continue to ignore the nonsense. This is a long game. You have to not engage on a long-term basis and be boring. Truth be told, the real key to all of this is not caring. And that's the hardest part. If they can still get an emotional reaction from you, then they're winning. They still have the power and control. As soon as you learn how to stop caring, you no longer engage in their nonsense. And then you win. Stronger.